Hello everyone, welcome back. I know you've all been waiting, desperately wondering what will happen when I buy the inn. Well, let's find out. I'm of course Bogmod, you continue to play more Crusader Kings 2. As we, uh... uh we'll call it the Mead Fountain. Alright, hold on. England doesn't seem involved in the war anymore. Maybe I can... push this. No. Sadly, I'm... I'm old and... Uh, my son, why? Why won't you let me educate the boy? 20% salt! I guess. No longer guardian of Prince Blah Blah Blah. Tragic. My wife, Princess of Scotland. There we go. A child that I will be able to... Uh, we'll get a traveling bard. Ah, yes. Two kids. So eventually I'll be hopefully able to push them onto the th Scottish throne. Keep the mead flowing. Thank you very much. And a nice little profit for me. And then I sell it. Oh, I made great strides. Great economic benefits. <laughs> Come on. Get me my scheme. I want to invade. But I can't. Yeah. Yeah. It's disappointing. But what can you do? Well, what we can do is we can t consider my options. County, no. No. County of Moray, no, no. Byzantine Empire. Wait a minute. I could claim the Byzantine Empire? Well, that's an interesting prospect, really. An Irish Byzantium. I fear, though, yes, with the with the military might at the young child's disposal, I could I would not have the have, have a, any chance at all. But still, it's hilarious to think that uh, this distant Irish king has a justified claim on the throne of the Byzantine Empire through his mother. One of the Byzantium princesses, who was born in the purple, no less. Ah, uh, yes. Mm. I really, I need to get onto this main island. Then I can really start to take out this region of stuff. Ah, uh, stupid holy wars! No, leave them alone. I need to get at them. Not you, me. Uh, blah, blah, blah. May your constitution. Blah, blah, blah. You better not use that. I will be an up upset man. No, oh, no more of them. Can even. Can I even declare against these guys? Or are they also too far away? Yep, too far away. There we are. My dearest, uh, how are we related? My half. So he's my brother-in-law. All right, that is acceptable to me. My brother-in-law is the emperor of the Byzantine Empire. My wife is pregnant again. And my grandson. Ah, oh, grandson. You're horrible. You're just... so horrible. Just terrible. Shalom is no longer my spy master. 
easily replaced with a buffoon. Let's build a city. The city will bring in income for me. And I'm stressed out. You know what? Dying would be great right now, in theory. It would let me have control of this these 10,000 men. Um, theory. I could then use that to properly wage the war that I want to wage. Hmm. I want to declare war on you, but I can't. Which is a shame, even though we're just we're so close. Uh, pity. Uh, my half brother is worth. I will. Don't worry, brother. I will find you someone wonderful. How about this Byzantine princess? Here we are. I'm dead. King Dungeoned. Interesting. It skipped. My dad. We erred. Okay. Well. First of all, a new spy master. Ambition. First ambition. Get married. Uh, educate these. Uh, I've ended up with a terrible, terrible king. I'll show you in a moment how terrible he is. Alright, so, here we are. No intrigue. He's angry and li and fat, and a priest. But at least he's just. But yeah, he's terrible stats. <sighs> Princess of Scotland. That would be my mother-in-law sort of deal. Mm. Could marry an English princess. 11 years old. Hmm. I gotta, I gotta choose something I can really take advantage of. Italian princesses. Hmm. Could you're in Leinster. Heir to the Duchy of Leinster. Hmm. Alright, I think... Yes, I think I'm going to have to go for the English princess and try to unite the two thrones. Alright, English princess. So, we'll just check out, check out the king over here. Range marriage. Oh, sorry. Arrange betrothal between herself, Princess of England, and me, King of Ireland. I may have to wait a few years, but... But it is acceptable. Hmm. Eh. I do want more legalism. Let me have larger territories. All right. Well, hopefully we can still get on here. Uh, we're still working on that goal. Uh, blah blah blah. Press his claim. So another another attempt on Byzantium. And once again, uh, thirty thousand men that won't go. Anywhere. Because the computer doesn't know how to launch boats. You know, there's, I know there's another update coming out. Well, respective to when I record this, there's an update coming out soon. And I would like to see that happen. Alright. Do I... I might have to go with some murders. My brother. My dearest brother. 
Oh, I can't get you married because you're off being a wanker. Ah, uh, uh, is what I say to that. So, I mean, uh, thirty thousand. You know, a well-done invasion with thirty thousand men into Byzantium might actually win it. Uh, it is conceivable. However, however, because the AI doesn't know how to use boats, not a chance. They're going nowhere. Cathel, my vassal. Why do you hate me so much? Because I'm a terrible person? It is because I'm a terrible person. There we are. You can be my keeper, my swans. Here's some money. And you. Why do you hate me? The usual reasons. And I'll give you a gift of also cash. Uh. I'm not in a strong position. This could see the entire course of Ireland change. <sighs> But I got a new city. All right. Well, I might be blackmailed. The true ruler of Ireland. Sorry. I reject your claim. Military gathering my hosts. Ooh. I will call on my ally. Ah, oh, you were supposed to join me. If he had joined me, that would have been quite the little uh, advantage. All right, well, let's assemble my armies. And let's take out my enemies. Mm -hmm. There we are. Unyielding. How dare they? Uh, I captured him in battle. I could ransom him for 250 gold. Uh, yes, you know what? I'm going to ransom him. Uh. Yes, we're going to ransom him. And you say, why? Because I want the cash. The cash I can use for mercenaries. And I can still win this war easy enough. we got to enhance legalism again. And then we're going to enhance castle infrastructure. My cousin. Alright, I'm going to ask... Could you take care of my my cousin? Hopefully she'll like me a little more if I have her do that. Who's this? Some carling bastard, right. You need an education. I can still take them out if they if they revolt. I've got cash now. So with cash reserves, a big help. Soon Leinster will fall and all will be mine. Petty King of Cornwall. Who is this gentleman? My courtier. Oh, Oh, actually, I might want to press this claim. In fact, I think I will press this claim. Once I'm done with this, at least. Yes. Uh, an absurd request. Sorry, mayors. Fuck you all, I want your cash. I want to be honest. 
Yes. Honest will give me diplomacy. And I need diplomacy. Uh, same for the pain plus. Eh, plus three dipl diplomacy helps. Makes them like me just that little bit more. See? Minus three now instead of minus 19. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Ransom. People for cash. And then I'm going to hire some mercs. Just in case his newly found soldiers. There we are. Military. Duk, duk, duk. Ransom. Release. My vassals will like me more. I'm going to release him from prison. Let's try to. Uh, there we go. See, they like me again. Uh, but he is trying to strip my title. I'll try to make him disappear. Excellent. Ah, I know exactly what I can do now. Pilgrimage time. That will make people like me more. Uh, you know what? I'm going to go to... Uh, what's in the west? What's that in the west? Oh. I guess I can't go to Constantinople. I was kind of hoping I could. All right. Uh, the tomb of Saint James in Santiago. What to do? I packed my things. My dearest mother, Princess of Hungary, Queen Mother of Ireland, Regent of Ireland. Why can I have inherited her brilliance? Oh well. <laughs> All right. I will, of course, yes, help out this poor man dying in a ditch. You need to get married. Anyone have any useful traits around here? Nope. Mm -hmm. All right. Santiago. You finally arrived in Santiago, the oldest major pilgrimage site in the West. It's an inland town close to the Atlantic Ocean. The ones are going back at least to the Roman Empire. The fabled Way of St. James is a, lo it's a long road to travel. You have passed through many towns and villages on your way here. The legend holds that St. James' remains were brought here by a ship from Jerusalem. They were lost at sea due to a storm, and soon after, they were miraculously washed ashore, covered in scallops. Because of those scallop shells, we become popular souvenirs among pilgrims. Mind dwells in the legend of this holy place. You make way way through the crowds towards the center of town. Yes, get a scallop. And, uh, yeah, we all thought it was pretty awesome. And yay, I'm a pilgrim. That makes my people like me just a little bit more. Yay! See, look, she actually likes me now. Now then, Claire War. I believe that's who was it I wanted? Is it you? Yes. Claim Cornwall. Send military. Fleets. Yay, and I've got more fleets too now. Everything's coming up Ireland. So yeah, see, I put them in control here. And then, once they're in control, I can... Later on, I'll be able to press a claim of one of my, my goons. And then we'll take that land for ourselves. It's a cunning stratagem. It may take decades, but, uh, you know. You do what you gotta do. Dearest cousin, marry that Basilius. We're gonna, we're gonna stay close to the Greeks. Land in Somerset. You can head home. You guys arranged into a proper military battle formation. Yeah, delete you. Murder your face. Murder your face. 
We slew a goatee. Good work. Yeah, I guess. Can I? Do I? Do I have the option of? Yes, I could even siege this place down. Interesting. I would like them to lose, because then I could take it all of Cornwall. And I press that thing. Sure, but, pal. You're, you're never going to make it off the island. Huh. Are they my enemy? My frenemy? Eh, I'm not sure. But uh, we'll have to do our scheme next time. But we have it. We have a goal. Our first real way into our, uh, England. We're gonna we're gonna manipulate things in Cornwall, play around with the succession, and then it'll be ours. Thanks everyone for watching, and I'll see you all next time.